Hey folks, it's Billy DKY, the truth seeker that simplifies and demystifies. This is going to be my advice to Muslims, Christians, and religious people in general. Just keep us real simple. Your shit is outdated. It's over 2,000 years old. It's causing you to kill people and fight with people from all over the world. So obviously your religion is not producing the results that you were truly hoping for, which was to be a greater to be at greater harmony with the essence of life. Allah and God are the same fucking thing, so quit fighting each other. You know what I'm saying? God's the same as Allah. It's the same thing in Taoism. You got the Tao's the same thing as God or Allah. We're all families. We're all we're all part of the earth. We're all brothers and sisters. I can have sex with a Muslim and have a kid. I can have sex with a Christian and have a kid. I can have a sex with any other human on the face of the earth and probably have a kid. You know, so when it's a woman. So you need what back up to the bigger question again, as always. What the hell is the purpose of you being in your religion? Is the purpose of being in your religion is to go off fighting each other, fighting somebody that don't agree with your exact beliefs? Hell no. If you got involved in your religion, the point of being in your religion is to have a better life, not to be a fucking radical. It's fucking obvious it's to have a better life, not to be a radical. Sorry about the rough language. We're going to get a little rough because sometimes somebody needs to put a mental ass beating down on you. Again, your shit is outdated and it ain't producing the results you want anyway, so let go of the 5,000 pounds you carried around on your back from over 2,000 fucking years. It's ridiculous. Drop the fucking weight and feel the freedom. It's what the fuck you got on your spiritual path anyways to find some freedom. It wasn't to be a damn radical. Alright. Okay, I'm telling you what to get rid of. Now I'm going to show you the future. This is the future regardless if you know it or not. Regardless if you like it that somebody's figured it out and it ain't you. Tough shit. You, again, your goal is... To have freedom in this life. It don't matter if you figure it out. Are you the one that figured out a wheel? Do you drive a car? Are you pissed off that you ain't the one that figured out a wheel? Well, don't be pissed off because it ain't you. Don't turn it into a damn ego battle. Somebody's showing you a new way that's better than what you've been taught. Sit down and learn it. You know what I'm saying? Don't be a douchebag. Say, no, nah, my, my shit's the best. I'm still using DOS 1.0. My DOS 1.0 is awesome. I can't get on the internet because ain't no ain't updating DOS 1.0 for me. I mean, you ain't on DOS 1.0. And trust me, your man, your chosen savior back in the day, he didn't have every fucking thing figured out. And I know because I do know. Because I sought it for myself. I got it directly from reality. I ain't saying I'm God or nothing. I'm just a really smart guy who learned it for himself. Because I had to. Okay. Again, evolve or get exploited. If you stay being a Muslim, a Christian, or whatever religion thing you got going on, you're going to get exploited by the people who understand what I'm saying because they're going to be on a higher level than you. This is the future right here. Following in the way of growth. Nine common sense principles for achieving your full potential. I'm not going to go through the whole thing again because I've been through it many times in other videos. You can go look that up. First principle. I'll just give you a quick list of the principles. Apply yourself. What the hell could be wrong with actually doing the work of improving as a human being and trying to grow? Next step. Baby steps. Of course, look at a tree. Look how a tree grows. Baby steps. Discipline. Attention. Question everything. What's wrong with questioning things? Nothing. Know your teacher. Reality. Notice I'm bringing the, the beauty of... Notice what we had. I mean, I've studied all the religions. But buffalo. You know what I'm saying? Plus science, the religion of science. And science teaches you things, how to question things. So I bring all of it together that's important. Plus my own little spins on it. Know your teacher reality. There ain't nothing wrong with that. Notice I ain't putting no man above you. Teach your enemy, ego and pleasure. Seek harmony, peace, simplicity. What the hell is wrong with that? Nothing. Notice what's not in there. Not. Let me start out by saying I'm 100% straight. But I mean, let's look at all these religions. Every one of them will beat the gays down. Don't get me wrong, I ain't a huge fan of the gays. However, 
I ain't, I, I'm not for leaving anybody out that needs to be included because everybody's on this earth for a fucking reason. I don't know exactly why gays are here. They just are. It's just the way it is. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to go out killing them or hating them. I mean, they're people too. You know what I'm saying? And, and notice, none of this is about hating. This, none of this is about hating. This is all about getting rid of all the... The beauty of FWG is this. It tells you everything that works and doesn't have anything in there that doesn't work. The problem with most religions is they have, a, they have some stuff that works and they have some stuff that doesn't work. That's fine. I'm a cleaner. I'm, I'm a spiritual cleaner. I clean the bullshit out. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all need to quit fighting each other. I mean, seriously, it's ridiculous. This is the future, and if you don't get on board, you just lose out. I mean, it's, you know, let's see what else I've got to say. Again, y'all all saying the same damn thing anyway. It's just a slightly different bent. I've known it from the beginning. It's, it's ridiculous. If your religion is so great, then why is it for, so easy for other religious people or people in like South Park to piss you off? It's because your religion ain't that great. You know what I'm saying? If, you, if you're that easily insulted, guess what? You ain't really enjoying the benefits of a real spiritual path, which is to come to terms with peace with yourself on ego. Because when somebody has the ability to piss you off so easy, like the South Park, the thing of uh, Muhammad and the image, I mean, it's, it's all ego-based. They're, they're just mental, they're, they're renting space in your head. Easily renting space in your head. Okay. <sighs> Summarize. I know I got a little rough language on you, but it, I feel like I had to. I feel like it was necessary. Again, your, your shit is outdated. Christians, your, your shit's outdated. Muslims, your shit is outdated. Those, da those days are over. We're, we're into a new phase of life. For humans to evolve to the next level, we got to come together as a people. And you may think, no, nah, I ain't going to do it, Billy DK. Why, I'm going to stay a Muslim. I'm going to stay a Christian. That's fine. You've been warned. I'm telling you, you've been warned. If you don't learn how to get the hell along with everybody, guess what's going to happen to you? You're going to get extinguished from the fucking face of the earth. That's exactly what's going to happen. Is it going to happen tomorrow? No. Am I saying I'm threatening you? No, I'm not threatening you at all. I'm telling you how it really is. You can either get on board with moving forward or you're going to be exploited or killed. It's just that damn simple. It's not a real hard concept. Seriously, move the hell on. Oh, Billy D.K.Y., you don't understand how great my religion is. You haven't studied it. Yes, I've looked at all your religions and they all fall short. If your religion was so damn great, guess what would not have been developed because I wouldn't have none needed it. FWG wouldn't have been needed, so I wouldn't have developed it. I studied it all. I've studied Zen. I've studied Buddhism. I've studied Taoism. And they've all fallen short of what... what and, and I've studied science as well. Science was my first endeavor, really. I bring it all together in a simplified, easy to understand, common sense way without any bullshit and shit that frees your mind from all the mental irritation that you have on a day-to-day -day basis. I, you know, it's, it's as good as it gets. It's as good as it gets right now. Now, in the future, again, if you want to check the blog out, it's down. It's still a work in progress because it's an evolutionary thing. You know what I'm saying? It's a, I, I, it came about last September. I finally brought it all together. And now it's just getting it down and making you understand the vision that I see and how powerful it really is. So, The world's going to be brought together. And as the world gets smaller with the internet and whatnot, we're going to have to come together under a unifying concept because we know Christianity can't take us to the next level. We know Islam can't take us to the next level. We know there's not a religion out there that takes the next level. Except falling away of growth. Falling away of growth can bring anybody together because it doesn't have cherished beliefs of killing each other and fighting each other in the name of God or molesting kids and all kinds of radical bullshit from the antiquity. You know what I'm saying? Quit justifying your damn ignorance and get on board with the new program. Or again, you will get exploited or killed. I guarantee you it's coming. And if you don't, if you don't get exploited or killed, your kids will get exploited or killed because that's just the way it is. You're passing on stupidity to your kids. 
and your grandkids and kids after that. Your ancestors, you'll be like the Native Americans. You'll get exploited when the white man comes in. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not, I'm not saying that's the white man. I'm just saying when the next, there'll be things that happen that will, you're setting yourself up and others in the future and your gene pool and people will know you and listen to you, you're getting them hurt. That's my advice. Take it for what it's worth. It's free. If you don't listen, you will get hurt because these ain't my ideas. This is just shit that I figured out because I needed to know what worked. Because I wanted a better life and this stuff works and it's simple. Till the next video. Again, I'm not trying to piss you off. I'm trying to give you advice that will help you save your ass and protect you in the future as best possible. Till the next video later, folks.